Hi guys, welcome back to another plan with me and this is the first plan with me in my A5 Daily Duo in my rings. So I got the agenda style. I wanted to try this out so that I could, you know, insert things, take things out. So far I'm liking it. It's different than a coil for sure. But this is the first plan with me of 2022 in this planner because I kind of, I don't know, I guess I was in a planner rut even at the beginning of the year, which sounds crazy, I guess. But I just was feeling really uninspired and I was kind of mainly using this as checklist type stuff. As, you know, as the days went on, I actually did go back and kind of fill some stuff in. So it's not my, it's not my best work, I guess, but you know, whatever, it's okay. I just, I decided I didn't have that many, that many kits for this planner. I had only ordered probably about two or three just to try it out because I had actually gotten 18 months worth of inserts just to try it. Honestly, I was so focused on finishing my seven by nine. I never did finish, um, or I never did really play around in here. So I think that's probably part of the reason I had such a hard time getting going at the beginning of the year. So anyway, all of that to say, one of my big focuses this year is just being more mindful of how much I'm spending. And I spent a lot of money on stickers last year, guys, like it, it was not great. So I'm just trying to be a little bit more mindful. And so I decided for this planner this year, I think I'm going to challenge myself to not buy any kits because I'm really enjoying my TPC Nation planner and all the kits that I've been getting for that, that I got from the TPC Loop especially. But I just decided I'm going to use leftovers for the Daily Duo and just kind of challenge myself to use leftovers, use um, things that I have like functionals from Avalon and Ninth. I have a lot of those that I like. I love using splashes from um, Shameless Stickers. I love using Snart from Tipsy Dog Designs. I'll link all of these people below. Anyway, I just, I thought between all of those things, I'm sure I can come up with a way to plan in here because at the end of the day, I really am using this planner for work and also kind of documenting a little bit as I go. Like I use the checklist for work and for home and then I like to kind of use this to document like my mood, what all happened throughout the day, and I use this as a guide in my memory planning. So that's, that's, I'm just trying to kind of get back to basics, I guess I should say. So that is my plan with all of this. As you can see, I pulled out a bunch of planner cage sheets. Some of these are empty, so I can say thank you for your service, but I wanted to use up this washi. And so I figured I could use that up here and then I have these pretty cute planner like date headers so I thought that would be nice and then I have these RG paper, RG paper designs date dots that would go perfectly there and I have all the dates that I need so that is what I'm going to do I think for this week and then I'm going to use some leftover like of these check or you know these used to cover up here they might still i haven't really checked it um i don't know if it would still line up because this is a smaller size but anyway i was going to use these to make little um to make my duolingo and read uh check boxes so i have those two that these are ones that i make myself at home um i have a silhouette that i just use for personal use printables whatever um and i actually use it for memory planning too maybe one day i'll do a memory plan with me um, I'm a little self-conscious about those because it's, it's such a messy process in my head. So I don't know how I would organize it for a video, but maybe I will try to come up with that one day and, and, um, and film that. But I will say with, sorry about all the yapping, but I will say that I think I will have all of the finished spreads like all of these i will have pictures of these on my instagram so go follow me over there i love that the harry potter um anyway i will have all of those finished spreads posted on my instagram and i like to post my memory spreads on instagram too so go follow me over there at ally and plans and uh, sit back and relax i have some water in my usual cup france cup super excited we're going to go back next month and I cannot wait because it's my birthday. So it'll be fun. So anyway, I have water, but you know, drink what you like and sit back, relax and plan with me.
We break up and you slam the door. I messed up on the bedroom floor. You know what? I'm gonna take these out of the rings. What the hell do we do this for? I put. I'm gonna go ahead and say thank you for your service. You up, but you come back. That attraction, we can't fight that. Oh, keep telling myself that I should let go. But I hold on. And oh, keep telling myself that I should move on. But I don't. We got. I'm gonna go ahead and say thank you for your service on this one, too. I'm actually going to pull this off and use it to stick on this leftover washi. Because there's a, about that much left on each sheet. So I'm going to use that because I don't no sticker left behind. I think that's what on the admin says. And then thank you for your service. There's something so satisfying about finishing like a complete sheet of stickers. Washing and all. So nice. That mad love. We got that sad love. We got that fun love. We got that young love. Yeah, that dumb love. We got that mad So that is everything set up how I want it to. So I really love this. And I think this will really lend itself to lots of opportunities for, you know, using leftovers and using lots of fun functionals and snark and splashes and all the fun things because this is kind of like a rainbow week. So I can kind of choose a different color each day or I can just make it like a whole rainbowy explosion, which I might do that. So we will see. Before I forget, I want to do my Wacky Doodle year. This is from Sammy Doodle Designs. So this is for January. We have National CRNA Week is this week. So I might put that actually on my monthly. And then we have National Popcorn Day is the 19th. I haven't decided yet. I probably will just because I have FOMO. But like I talked about earlier, I'm trying not to spend too much money and especially on stickers but i get the chris Gann designs collection every year or i've gotten it now every year since i think 2020 so that was my first year to get it and i absolutely love it let's see the 24th is the next one so i think yeah that's it for this week and then we have national cigar night week i might actually put that on monday okay and then that is it for January for now. So I'm going to put this away. But like I was saying, I haven't decided yet if I'm going to get the Christian Designs collect, uh, Celebration Collection, which will have all the holidays and things like that. Like I said, probably will because I have FOMO. But 
for now, I'm just doing the Sammy Doodle designs. I'm trying to limit how many wacky holidays I have to, you know, remember to put in this year. So, um, like I said, just trying to keep it a little more simple this year with this daily planner, just because um, I'm trying to mainly use this as like checklist and and then I use the schedule section for sort of a memory keeping type. Uh, you know, I do put in meetings if I have meetings or appointments or anything like that ahead of time. But for the most part, because work has been variable in the past, I'm hoping to get a lot more, I'm hoping to set up some more routines this year. And so I hope to get, you know, where I can set up, like, I'm going to be at work every day at this time, but I'm just not quite there yet. Oh, I do know that Aaron has um, a procedure on the 20th for his face he has a vein malformation and so they have to go in and work on that and it's in his face so it's you know it's very noticeable and it um it causes one side of his face to grow at a different rate than the other because of the blood in that vein it's the way the vein was formed when he was in the womb so anyway that is on thursday but i don't know what time because i usually call like the day before at the time so i might just stick a post-it as a reminder but I have a feeling I'm not going to forget about that. I think for now that's all I'm going to put in because I like to add in a lot of stuff as I go, like you've seen before. But thank you so much for um, for th sticking this out with me and um, letting me talk your head off at the beginning. Anyway, I think this will be lots of fun though. So go check out my Instagram if you want to see how it all turns out after the fact. And I will post my finished spreads over there. But I just, I love this and I think this will really make a fun week happen. So I haven't even done Sunday yet. That's funny. Anyway, I will see you guys in the next one. Please like, share, subscribe, all those things. And I will see you in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.